Okay, so, so in this map, there's two this nodes that you have to defend. Makes orcs dance. Well, I can make orcs dance too. And by dance, I mean die when I poke them with my blade staff. Pretty much, you don't really need that much in this map. It's mostly just barricades, archers, maybe a wee bit of brimstone and tar. So you're gonna want to block off one way. Traps are just so, cool. so I'm gonna block off the right path. Then you I want to block off the this. center so no one can just cheat and go through the middle. Then you put all your traps on this side of the map. So I don't think you really need too many traps that early on. Usually you can just hold them off with your own character. My bow is yours. But still, you should probably have some. I usually get archers in case one gets through, because at least they can pick off runners. Okay, I'm gonna unleash the horde. Headshot. Cool now for something That was pretty simple. Next wave is about to begin. Traps. Dang, we run over to this side. I just want to keep on aiming for the head. Okay. Now you want to try and direct the days, little one. Submit. Oh, please don't send me more orcs, scary woman's voice. How could I possibly survive? Brave and foolish both. You will beg for mercy before we are through. Ooh, big words for someone who hides behind a bunch of dumb orcs. Your order has known of me for years, child, and I know them. I was up here once. Uh huh, uh huh. Yeah, I do Which one? Which one? I like that rather than just walk through the middle, I walk around to like the least normal position. But I finally got enough money to block off that side. So now they have to come through the oil pot. That's pretty simple. So now you want to put tar to slow them down when they have to walk across. Those guys unleash the next hard. So 
I'll just elves. So werewolves are kind of annoying. But if you use the ice amulet, you got to freeze them on top of the lava. Let's talk. More orcs, please. And you just turn the lava on them. That should easily kill them. Then you get lots of bonus coins. Coins. So you don't really need to double layer the arrow walls, since if you upgrade them, you get extended range so they can actually reach both sides. So it's kind of pointless. Plus, we're pushing them into the center. So, again, you don't really need to put them on both sides of the wall. You do quite often get stragglers over here though. In this one little room. Just let's go try and pick him off. Headshot. Sweet. So basically, next thing you want to do is block off this gateway. So then they have to do like a zigzag motion to get to the open area. And then you can kind of just hold them off in this room with your character for a while. Because it will take them a while before they make it through. Oh no, you do have to block off the middle again on this side. Which I quite often forget to do, but oh well. Damage on all freed bits of all freed bits of tar. That one's for you, old man. Nice. Now I can quickly run over here. I'm gonna block off this middle part. Something for your face. Now they are going to have to walk all the way around. And then you want to kind of like block this path off as well. But there's werewolves coming, so I'm going to quickly run to my archers. Because they can jump over barricades. So, I kind of want to get them quite well. Another. There's a lot of oil on the There we go. Good thing about this is that the werewolf comes in quite slowly. So it gives you more chance to pick them off. Clean up on aisle three. Uh, bye bye. Kill them all. In the face. Oh, it's pretty easy this one. I'm just gonna go to the next round. Uh, I'm gonna place. Uh, should I now? So yeah, I'll place some just here. A treat for you. That makes I feel like a double one. Cool. Then I'm gonna place traps. Force my control. 
My archers should be able to hold off those little dog things, or the runners. Now I'm just going to place more tar to slow them down. I'm just gonna go up to this top part and place some archers. Place some archers. Cool. And I'm gonna get Steel Weaver power. Embrace your inner And the Death Augmenter. Once again, enough money. Decisive. I like that. Their archers. Alright, let's get back up, wait for him to reach the final tar. There we go. That should take care of most of them. Classic! This guy, you can just freeze them in the middle ish. Uh, on time for the oil. So pretty much, if the path gets too blocked off, they'll walk back and try and find another path. So, you don't really have to worry too much. Yeah, all this arch is so annoying. And I'm just going to continuously walk around and around, being annoying. Oh. Into the head. Winning. There you go. Okay, now I'm going to get some brimstone stuff. And step right this way, channels. Mr. Rourke. Werewolves incoming. I think they're gonna go for the rude pony doctors. Pretty much we're dead. Okay, final rounds. Just wait for them to reach the last one. There we go. That was pretty simple. Now I'm just gonna get death. Oh, know what you want. That way I can get bonus money. Lame trying to blow it up. 
Yeah, I think I'm gonna get archers for up here as well. Not like a whole lot, but just enough. Burn him. In your face. Just place them in the way to slow other people down. And hopefully it will also bring in the werewolves. Try and like force them. And rule the tar. Wait. An archer has fallen. An archer is down. An archer has fallen. Not an archer has fallen. Apparently, an archer has fallen. <laughs> That was cool. Salsa! 